so I'd like to take you to where I usually play. It's almost always nighttime, so I want to make sure I'm playing someplace that I don't disturb everybody. So we're racing through the station. Привет, Oleg. Oleg and I are the, night, the late night people. So through the US lab, and around the corner, and a straight through would be the Russian segment, and around the corner, through node three, which doubles as our gym and our bathroom and our everything else. And then one of my favorite, favorite places, the cupola. Hello to the DART International Music Festival, and welcome to the International Space Station. I'm Katie Coleman, a NASA astronaut and a flute player. So when I found out that I was selected to live and work on board the International Space Station, the first thing I tried to do was figure out how to get my flute on board. And the next thing I tried to do was to figure out how to bring other peoples with me. Because space is so special. I've been here twice before, but never really lived here. And I, I know how special it is, and it's the kind of place and, and experience that you really want to share and to help other people understand that space belongs to all of us. And one way I thought to do that was to bring some flutes with me. So I actually have m uh, my own flute. I have a silver flute from Mr. Ian Anderson of the band Jethro Tull. I have an Irish flute from Mr. Matt Malloy of the Chieftains. It's a beautiful instrument, I think uh, more than 150 years old. And I also have a tin whistle from Mr. Patty Maloney of the band, also of the band, the Chieftains. And I bring, I carry the three of these around. They each have their own t-shirt that I wrap them in. And, uh, and I then Velcro that t-shirt to different uh, places and carry them around in a little bag around the space station. But this is the place that I generally like to play. Um, up here in the cupola of the space station. And let me just put them down so I can show you around. This is in the middle of the space station. And in general, my free time is at night. And so I want to play someplace that I'm not going to disturb everybody else. And so I come here in the middle of the space station. We generally sleep at either end of the space station. Our crew is sort of split like that. And I come up here to the cupola. And let me just show you why I love being up here and playing music here. It is a totally, totally amazing experience. Let's see, I'll open a window here. Turn this around so I can see too. And you can see that we are in a simply, simply amazing place. And the cupola is a marvelous place because it has windows on all sides. And we can see the Earth. We're crossing the U.S. as we speak. And you can see it's just beautiful here kind of close quarters. <laughs> you might also be able to see that. Yeah, we're just, uh, we're just in the middle of the country. Here's our newest supply ship, the HTV. Colin Espelay and I just birthed it uh, today. And uh, then I'll show you the view overhead, which is straight down at the Earth. I think we might be over exactly Denver as we speak. I'm not positive, but it looks like Denver to me. So now it's time to do what I think we all love to do, and that is play music with friends. I'm going to play a song called Honey, I Miss You. It's written by Joel Ratchiff, Brendan McKenney, sung by my friend Mickey Pettit, and I'm going to play with my band back home, Bandella. Let's see. Buttered muffins have always wagged my tail. I ain't had no loving since they hauled you off to jail. Honey, I miss you. 
Nothing's broken and the bed is closed. Work me on good behavior. Honey, get yourself a room. You're stubborn and hot-headed and always quick to fight. Don't give them any reason. Keep you one more night, honey, I miss you. Keep your cool stay in control. Oh, oh, oh be on good behavior. Honey, get yourself a room.